How to delete def defined names in Excel. In Excel, I am able to define a name for either a cell or a range of cells. This is useful when I'm creating formulas and want to refer to a particular cell or range of cells. If I have named the cell or range of cells, then it is easier to refer to it when I'm creating the formula and when reading the formula. To both create and delete defined names, I use the name manager, which is under the formulas menu in the defined name section. I click on name manager. This shows me all the named shell, named ranges, named cells in the current sheet. So here I see that I have the fixed cost, labor, material cost, and sales price. So from this window, I can either create a new one or I can delete a defined name that has already been created. Here I want to delete labor. To delete a single one, I can select just one and click delete. Or I, holding the shift key down, I can select multiple uh, names and then click delete. In this example, I'm going to delete only one. We get a warning Excel asks if we're sure that we want to delete and I say OK and close this window. Now let's see what happens if I delete the fixed cost because the fixed cost has been used in this formula. So if I go to name manager and delete fixed cost and say OK, at once there's an error shown because I've deleted that name and Excel doesn't know which cell is being referred to. I'm going to con press Control Z to undo this change. So this is just to uh, show you that before deleting a named uh, a defined name, it's better to ensure that it is not used in any formula or go to the formulas in which it is used and replace it with the value. So this is how to delete defined names in Excel. Please read the appended article for more information.